So what's going on? Where are you at? What's, what's the deal? Well, the deal is that this has turned out to be a lot more complicated than I thought. I'm working on the reef for the Ocean Manor Resort, and our job is to turn this tank from a sad Cinderella to the belle of the beach. Since the tank divides two very different rooms, my bright idea was to build a reef that's completely different on each side. I want to make sure that when you're looking through here, you don't see the other reef. That's going to be the trick. So I have, like, the pagoda now, the bridge. There's, like, a Japanese garden, Mount Fuji. But it's just not coming together the way I hoped. It's a lot harder than I thought to try to make it two completely different sides and not be able to see one through the other and make it look good. The problem is I need swim-throughs. I want to have swim-throughs through it, but if I have swim-throughs, then you're going to see the stuff on the other side. Fish need places to hide. Losing the swim-throughs is just not an option. Every time I think I got it figured out, OK, that's going to work, and then I swing around to the other side, I see it, and I'm like, no, that's not going to work. But what I'm really concerned about is the tree. I want to make a gorgeous tree with cherry blossoms, and it's got to be spectacular. So this is going to be a big element. It's going to be really colorful, really powerful, beautiful tree. See, the tree originally was going to sort of follow that contour, that shape, but it's going to look flat. So the only thing I can think of now is build this side out and then worry about how I hide it from the other side. You got a lot to figure out here, Chief. Yeah. I have to figure out a way to make this cherry tree a beautiful centerpiece element that's completely disguised from the other side. If I can't deliver on this, I failed. It's not going to look good if I start cutting corners. <laughs>